Hi, my name is Mahmoud. I'm a senior flash developer. Today I will explain how could you load an XML file using JavaScript. Let's get started. I will open Microsoft Visual Web Developer 2008 XFS Edition and go to File New Website. Make sure that you check C Sharp I'm using in my tutorial. And we'll name my project XML Proj GS. Click OK. OK, I will create a simple XML file. Add a new item XML. I will call it my data. Let's write our XML file. So uh, it will be a phone list. So it's a person. Okay, change the numbers. And save the file. Open the default at SBX. Uh, writing some JavaScript code. So starting my script and the language. So JavaScript. Okay. And I will declaring for a variable to uh, get an instance object of Ajax. I will explain in the next tutorials what is Ajax. You must know first it with Ajax you can uh, change a parts of the page without reloading the whole page. So uh, the actions or the data you send and receive it happens in the secure side uh, without any kind of re refreshing the pages or loading the page you saw it in a mini web page today it's faster and secure okay so I will check the browser you using if it uh, Internet Explorer 7 or higher Firefox, Chrome, Opera using window dot XML HTTP if this object exists. So if so, let's our variable called as an AJAX object. equal new XML HTTP or if you are using Internet Explorer 5 or 6 it will be different here so the Ajax object equal new ActiveX object of Microsoft dot xml HTTP. so that's fine no problem uh, so I will declare a variable 
hold before we uh, made the load of XML file I will send I will open the XML file to load it through get and set the XML file path and turn off the synchronous loading ok and send the request ok and this is an object holding the XML data through response XML ok I want to viewing the XML data in a table to do that do the next let's document dot write a symbol table Okay. Exporter equal to Okay. I will set a variable for holding the nodes of the person. that so PRS set for person for example it's equal to my XML dot get elements by tag name it's called person make sure Yes, and go to a for loop to set the rows and cells. Set it for i equal to zero i less than first dot. No, the I last pass. That's correct. And set the start of the row. TR. TD. And. right going to list the name and the numbers it's uh, recorded in an array so this is the first uh, child dot get elements by tag which is called name of zero to the child note 
the end of the row closing the tag that's fine and uh, document dot write table okay let's check this code you see I'm successfully uh, set get the data of my XML file but I will need some edit in the row so I will close it and make it an edit here uh, yes document dot write close the TD and open another TD check again yes so this is a way simple way uh, can loading an XML file data into your web page throwing JavaScript and Ajax thank you for watching and goodbye